Welcome back. Let's play TIE Fighter. Imperial patrols have located the secret base of Narwak ships carrying hyperdrive technology. The first objective is to stop the corvettes from escaping. Then get the shuttles and the transport, hopefully before the parked starfighters are activated. Heavy rockets it is. You will be among three groups of Thai bombers launched from the modified frigate Seamus. Okay. That's plenty. <clears throat> Again, I'm going to take out a lot of corvettes, hopefully. The Narwak are incensed that the Habin are willing to sell their jointly developed technology to the Empire. They have defied all attempts at peaceful negotiation and have recently threatened to sell the hyperdrive technology to the Rebellion. The Rebels could use this technology to upgrade their existing fleet of hyperdrive capable craft. We cannot let this technology be sold to the Rebels. Therefore, in this mission, we are launching an attack on the Narwak base, where the technology is being stored. Destroy all cargo-carrying vessels. Let no ship escape. You will be flying a Thai bomber designated Alpha-2. Your craft will be armed with six Proton torpedoes. You will have two others in your flight group. The Narwak are being supplied by the Rebels with older model starfighters like the Y-Wing. These craft will likely be used to defend their base. The base is also defended by corvettes. Okay, I'll just bring heavy rockets for the corvettes and try to clear out everything else. I wonder how many corvettes I will have killed at the end of this let's play. I have two capital ships to my name now, of uh, Nebulon B frigate and a cruiser, I believe. Bunch of containers, no secondary here. Carillion Corvette, Pator, and Shotgun. Had to do those first time. Switch to torpedoes and fire at will. Nobody is attacking this guy for the moment. I will do the honors. Alpha 2, get the Corvettes first. They are trying to escape. No, they're not. They're waiting. Oh, yeah, now they're going. There we go. Now I'm gonna need some lasers. This guy's after me. Alpha two, using your target for attack. Excellent work. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. This guy's also after me and he's locking me. That's unhealthy. Alpha 2, incoming missile. I got the missile. Request acknowledged, Alpha 2, using your target for attack. Well, there's plenty going directly after me for some reason. Maybe I'm just unlucky. Superb hunting Alpha 2, Alpha 2. This is flight group Alpha using your target for attack. Even a shuttle. So far everything I have targeted was also going after me. There's a button for that. Target you can press R. That's for the nearest target. You can press E. That's for the nearest targeting that has uh, target that is targeting you. There are a bunch of uh, keys for all kinds of stuff like that. You can press the A Alpha key to see who attacking is your tar who is attacking your attack. target. Target destroyed. They're attacking the shamus apparently. This transport is. Shouldn't be a problem really. Alpha two. This is Alpha one. Target destroyed. Radio 
message received. Alpha two. I'll just Secure continue hunting Y wings. Target destroyed. This guy attacking. Shameless as well. This is Gamma Two. Target destroyed. Excellent hunting, Alpha Two. This is Gamma One. Target destroyed. The Nawak base is falling. Somehow this transport's still alive. I will uh, clean up, of course. Won't leave right away. Excellent hunting, Alpha Two. And that's it. This was a rather easy mission, but I do not mind one bit. I do enjoy the the very tough missions as well, but uh, the occasional cakewalk is no problem. We'll rendezvous with the Seamus and uh, get debriefed. I do have to say, I do like the look of the modified frigates a lot better than uh, the original ones. Still, it's a kind of weird design, that long, long bridge. Let's see, all primary, there were no bonus goals in this. The Nawak base was eliminated, and the cargo containers and corvettes were destroyed. Further reconnaissance patrols are needed to determine if all the Nawak technology has been destroyed. Hmm. Emperor has no interest in this operation, it appears. The battle between the Habin and the Nawak for control of the hyperdrive technology continues. The Habin have requested our help. Their research facility is under Nawak attack. A pair of old corvettes that have just unloaded cargo are their only defense. The Habins need enough time to evacuate their base. All the rescue craft need to board containers. The Nawak are using Y-wing starfighters. It will be a slaughter if we do not stop them. Because of Y-wings being awesome? The modified corvette Phoenix will hyperjump there to intercept the attacking Y-wings. The battle between the Habin... Interesting. We will drop from a corvette this time. That will be our mothership. It's uh, very fragile, but I think I've demonstrated that. You are to stop an onslaught of Nawak Y-wings from destroying the Habin research outpost before it can be evacuated. Imperial intelligence has learned that in retaliation for our attack on their base, the Nawak are planning to launch a reprisal raid on the Habin Technology Research Center. Transport runner and two Imperial shuttles will rescue the base personnel. If the containers are destroyed before all three rescue craft have docked, you have failed in your mission. Mm -hmm. You will be flying a Thai bomber designated Alpha-1. Your craft will be armed with 16 concussion missiles for use in shooting the Nawak raiders. You will have two wingmen in your flight group. Yeah, I'll go for the torpedoes, I think. Uh, it's more effective against a lot of Y-wings. You can expect to confront the remnant Y-wings of the Nawak. Let's kill him. Yeah, torpedoes are better for shooting down Y-wings quickly. I think one torpedo will take down the shields and most of the hull, and then you can just finish it off with one or two laser hits. Concussion missiles just don't pack enough punch. In research area is dead ahead. Nawak Y wings are already making their attack run. Let's see. All Y wings destroyed, 75% at least. Uh, the Phoenix must have survived. Transport runner is probably key. And two shuttles. 
This might be an annoying operation because these are all very fragile craft. Let's just intercept as many as we can. Okay. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Alpha one. Target destroyed. Alpha one. Mission critical craft under attack. Alpha one. Mission critical craft under attack. Oh, <laughs> that was the wrong weapon. <laughs> Not a great start to this mission. There were lots of torpedoes already inbound. My god. I do hope uh, the right containers survive. Because if not, they will not be able to finish docking. But uh, we'll cross that bridge once we get there. Okay, both shuttles already finished docking, so it's just transport runner who has to uh, complete his mission. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Still one of those corvettes alive. It's at least a good distraction. Some of the Y wings are going after that one. And I cleared everything out. And here come some new ones. I intend to. Good hunting. Good shooting, Alpha One. Transport runner has finished docking, it's now entering hyperspace. Abort mission, mission of failure. And I failed the mission. Okay. Apparently uh, no, too many containers were destroyed. The beam base has fallen. All research lost. How could Imperial pilots fail against the Narwhal? Don't be so dramatic, we'll just try again. Let's uh, check out the special instructions. Use your wingmen to attack other Y-Wings while you deal with one yourself. Target and fire concussion missiles at the Y-Wings as quickly as you can. Transport runner and the two shuttles must dock with the cargo containers to rescue the base personnel. Uh, it's a bit annoying that you don't know at what point you exactly failed the mission. I'll just have another go. And uh, if it's a successful attempt, I will show you. The research area is dead ahead. And we are back in the mission. This is the third attempt because y -wings are already <coughs> making their attack run. Request for reinforcements acknowledged. Because I've just died because of the keyboard. Yes, 
It's annoying. Assault gunboat group move to Alpha One. We're here to help you. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Yeah, there's absolutely Target no destroyed. way to fix that. Alpha One. Mission critical craft under attack. Alpha One. Mission critical craft under attack. Radio message received. Using your target for attack. Transmission received. Using your target for attack. But I will do my best and try and figure this out. I asked for reinforcements just because I failed the mission. I got it, I think. Target destroyed. Excellent shooting, Alpha One. Transmission received, Alpha One. Using your target for attack. Received Alpha One using your target for attack. I guess you need just a little luck in this mission as well. Alpha One, this is Blink Group Alpha using your target for attack. I'm just checking on uh, ammunition, but apparently I had a double load because I still have eight missiles left. That's a lot. Transmission received. Using your target for attack. I want to be right on his tail. Cool, this thing is still performing docking operations, so let's hope he makes it. It's about half a minute. Country gunboats are leaving, so Alpha yes. One. Primary mission objectives completed. The Emperor will be pleased. The Habin transport was able to save their research team. We have cemented our relationship with the Habin. It took a few tries and the keyboard dying on me again and stuff like that, but we pulled it off. Let's head home. Debrief me, sir. Again, there were no bonus goals or secondary goals. We killed uh, 15 Y-Wings and that's it. You have driven off the attack and secured the area. The Habin were able to successfully evacuate their research team and vital equipment. The Imperial Navy's effort here has gone a long way in finalizing a deal between the Habin and the Empire for their hyperdrive technology. But, of course, the campaign is not done.
I think I will uh, call this a video and see you in the next.